Going to Scotland to the SNP spokesperson, Dr Philippa Whitford. Thank you very much, Mr Speaker. The risk of viral spread is not just influenced by the distance between people, but by the length of time they spend together. While research is measured in minutes, people could be sitting in a pub or restaurant for hours. Other factors include ventilation, the activity engaged in, and whether face coverings are mandatory or not. The government can't just wish away the fact that the risk of transmission increases as people get closer and more than doubles from two metres to one. Is it not safer to keep the distance at two metres, but work with all sectors to develop protective measures for when this isn't possible? This could be a combination of personal protection in the form of mandatory face coverings and structural, such as using glass or perspex screens between tables in restaurants. We all recognise the impact on the hospitality sector, but surely a second wave would be devastating. Minister. Well, I'm grateful to the um, Honourable Lady. And before I answer, may I um, put on record, on behalf of myself and colleagues on this side of the House, our very best wishes to the Honourable Lady, the Member for East Dunbartonshire, for a swift and full recovery. And I hope that the Honourable Lady will be able to convey those sentiments to her when she speaks to her. She's not just a member of the SNP family, she's a member of the family of this House, and we all wish her very, very well. The Honourable Lady um, is uh, very well versed in these issues and is an eminent clinician in her own right. Um, we have made clear that it isn't just the two metre rule taken in isolation that is the only factor. She's right to highlight that broader context. It's not just about distance, it is about duration of contact, um, how close that contact was, whether there were measures in place to mitigate that, be it screens or, or other measures, the length of time. So she's absolutely right. And in this uh, debate today, in this urgent question, we must always remember this is not a binary question. It is not just the two metre rule or the distance rule and nothing else. We must look at it in the round, as the Chancellor rightly said, and as I believe um, the First Minister of Scotland has also said in this context. That is exactly what this review will be doing, looking at all those factors in the round to come up with appropriate scientific and economic advice to the Prime Minister and Ministers to take a balanced decision on.